Hey guys, welcome back to Get and Stay Fit, your blog for losing weight, keeping it off, getting fit, and feeling amazing. I'm Whitney Hawthorne, your host, and today we're going to roast the chicken breast. Fairly easy. I'm one person, so I'm going to roast one, um, but you can easily multiply this recipe. So let's start with the chicken. So here's my chicken. Um, my chicken breast, it's the, it's a split chicken breast, so that means that some of the rib meat's still attached. Um, it's got the bone and the skin on it. I'm not actually going to eat the skin, but I like to buy it this way because chicken breast can dry out. If you cook it with the skin on, um, it just helps to kind of keep the chicken breast very moist. So this is really quick, super easy um, prep time. It takes a little longer to cook, but it's easy prep. So I just washed this off, so I'm just going to pat it dry. Okay. Now he's uh, dry, set that down, and I'm going to um, season it with some salt and pepper. So here's some salt, here's some pepper, some more salt, and um, a few red pepper flakes. I love red pepper flakes. You could use cayenne pepper too. I don't, for some reason I like to really see um, the pepper flakes, so red pepper works for me. And then I'm going to add a little bit of olive oil. Okay, now here's how I do it. I know not everybody does it this way, so I just put everything on top, but you want it to kind of be all over the chicken and under the skin. So I just put all that on there, and now I'm just gonna like mush it all around, and then I'm gonna like actually lift up this chicken skin, pull it away from the breast some. So you see how my hand's under here now? Can you see that? I hope so. And um, push some of that seasoning underneath of it, wrap it all around it just like that. Good. And so you don't want to touch things again after you've already touched the chicken breast, and I'm not a fan of wash your hands, go back, wash your hands, go back. So um, that's why I kind of do it this way. Good. So just roll it all, get all the rest of that salt and pepper up off of this paper here. Good. And now I'm going to, I'm going to actually cook it in my toaster oven here. Um, what I'm going to do, I don't have a roasting pan yet, so I just ball up two little pieces of foil. See, these are two little foil balls. Just balled up the foil, and I just set them there so I can set the chicken on top of it. That's going to help it, and then just push ah, down a little, kind of helps to hold it in place. And that's going to help the heat to kind of rotate around the chicken, um, you know, and the fat juices to kind of drip off of the chicken. So that's it. That's my little chicken breast. I'm going to wash my hands now. All right, I heated my, I put my oven on 350. Well, it's, it was heating up, so I turned it up higher, but now it's at 350. And I'm just gonna set him in there. Good, set the timer for one hour, and you're done, that's it. I'll take a picture of what it looks like and post the picture, um, or maybe I'll see if I can splice the video somehow and, uh, and show you the end result. But you just leave him in there for about an hour. Um, you pull it out. If you have a meat th thermometer, uh, check and see that the temperature is about 160 degrees, 165 degrees, uh, so that you're safe. And you're good to go. You can do tons of things with the chicken breast. Uh, you can eat it just like that. You can shred it up and put it on salad. You could shred it up and put it, you know, on top of spinach and mushrooms, which is what I'll probably do um, with the chicken breast. That one's kind of big, uh, so I'm probably going to make two meals out of it. And that's it. That's how you roast the chicken breast. Um, all right. <laughs> Fairly simple, right? It's so quick. It's so easy. Um, you know, and eating smart's about that. It's about making the food easy. And you can see how you could do that with, you know, four or five chicken breasts. No problem. All right. Well, I'm Whitney Hoffman, your host. Thank you for tuning in to Get and Stay Fit, your blog for losing weight, keeping it off, getting fit, and feeling amazing, where we teach you how to act fit, eat smart, and be amazing.